Welcome guys, welcome to Lennox Benny channel with another in this series of people too. All right, so this video is going to take approximately 15 minutes because I have a class at 7. So um, I'll have to stop there. All right, so it says the diagram below, not drawn to scale, shows a prism of length 30 centimeter, which is this. The cross section WXYZ is a square with area of 144 centimeters square. So they give us that information. And the first thing they ask is for the volume of this, all right? So we know that for volume, I think I need a calculator. Let's just speed it up. So for volume, it's the area of the base times the height. So they already worked out for us nicely. So we know that the area is 144. So it would be 144. And then we multiply by 30. That should give us the volume because it's the area of the base times the height. So basically that would be the height 30. So it's 144 times 30, which works out to 4,320. 4, and we know that it will be CM3. All right, part two says the total surface area, I'm gonna change this to black. Black is powerful, guys, black is powerful. All right, the total surface area in centimeters square of the prism. Now, total surface area mean you're going to find the area of all the faces, say, of two identical faces, which is one here and another down here. And it really look like a square over here. Yeah. So one of these. So that would be 144 times 2. 2 4 is 8. 2 4 is 8. Two ones two. So right here, but this and the other side. So you have what? You have four other sides, right? One, two, three, four, and they are identical. Now, the fact that this is one forty-four centimeter square, it means that you would find the square root of one forty-four, which works out to what? Twelve. So we know the length of this is twelve. So this triangle, this rectangle right here, rather, would be 12 by 30. And then you have four identical ones. So it would be 12 times 30. And then we multiply that by four. Because remember, four of them, right? You have one here, so two here, so one panda side here, and the one with basically a sit on. So it's four of them. All of them is the same measurement. So it's 12 times 30 times four, which work out to 1,440. So it's 1,440. So all six sides are accounted before now. So now we can simply add it, right? So it's eight, carry two, seven, and that's four marks. And remember, it's area, so it's centimeter square. So this work out to 4,320, and this works out to 1728. Put the unit centimeter square for this, and then CM3 for this. All right, so that's six marks. Let's go level. Let me take a parody now, guys. Let's go. This one now, the diagram below not drawn to scale show the sector of a circle with center O. Angle MON, which is this angle right here, is equal to 45 degrees and ON, which is the radius, right? You realize that? It's a part of a circle. So this portion here is 5. All right. And they asked us to find what? They didn't ask us to find anything. Calculate, giving your answer correct two decimal places, the length of the minor arc MN. So we want to find the length of MN right here. So that's a part of the circumference. So that makes it an arc. So for the entire circle, it will be 2 pi r 
right, for the entire circle, times 45, because this portion here is subtended. We're going to consider this portion here, which is the 45. Oh, so that's a, that's a fraction of the circle, which is 360. So let's go. So let me see now. So this goes into itself one and this. So it's one eight, all right? All right, and for the rest of it, now it will be two. Let's say you use pi as 3.14, 3.14 times the radius, which is 15. And then we divide by eight, because it eight on the side. So let's work it out. May I just do one thing doing it, guys? Because we only have 10 minutes leave. So we're going to multiply. 2 times 3.14 multiplied by 15. That gives us 94.2. And then we're going to divide by 8. Now. So it's 94.2 divided by 8. I'm going to do that now. I'm going to tell you guys the answer. And the answer is, hold on. So it's 92, oh, 94.2, 94.2. Calculator is something else, 94.2 divided by eight. Which work out to 11. Point Seven seven eleven point. Let's write down everything first, and then we do the round off, so you guys can see eleven point seven seven five. So it's a round off the two decimal places. So this we go go to the third one. So it would be eleven point seven eight. And now they ask us for, and because it's length, it's just centimeters. All right. So it asks us for the perimeter of MON. So they want to find the distance. As I said, this side would be 15. This side would be 11.78, as they told us around it all. So it was with this plus this, right? So it's 11.78 plus 15 and 15, or 30. So that's it, I give you 41. And you get another two marks. You see how much nice? Come on, guys, just work with me. You can get your one, all right? And for the final piece, I think we have time. We're going to find, this is, the whole question is worth 12 marks. So for the final part, you're going to find the area of the figure MON. So this is a sector, right? So again, we consider the 45. We know so that's going to work out to 1, 8, right? So we're just going to say pi r square. Pi is 3.14 times r square, which is 15 times 15, and then we divide by 8. Remember, guys, just drag your memory. Area of a circle is pi r squared, and because it's a sector, times the angle over 360. And we established that it's 45 already, it was given. So this is work out to this, all right? And I'm going to just do one thing. Well, I finished so fast. I'm going to do one thing. Pause the video and try, guys, all right? Times 15, times 15. All right, that work out to 706. Sure that, right? Pi r squared, yeah. Divide by 8. I'm getting 11.03. So for the answer, it's... No, man, something all right, man. Hold on. I calculate a shaky. Hold on, guys. Such a big number. 3.14 times 225, which is 15 times 15. That work out to 706, you know? So 706 divided by 8 can be that. Awesome.
706 divided by 8, 88. Um, this calculator is a little bit shaky, so it's 88. So the error is 88.25. I think, I think um, I didn't round off that part. So this would be represent the error. Again, guys, if you need my number, I know some persons do. A lot, me, all right? Check out my marathon, them upcoming and all of that. Topic by topic, all right? Link me from early. I you know it's a, it's a Russian thing. All right, so this is my WhatsApp number. You guys can WhatsApp me, all right? This is the next minute, I'm out, no doubt. See you guys in another video. Big up, guys. Share with a friend to share with a friend, all right? Sabine, it is your friend to the very end.